Hey, what's up? Consistency 101 is back. How y'all doing? Out there today, I'm doing a quick video on how to use your rubber bands or elastic bands. Some people call them elastic, some people call them rubber bands. I'm going to show you a quick workout tip. It's butterflies, but it's another video on how to show another way how to use them. Now, if you out or the workout gym or whatever, and you have a, a pole that's nearby or anything like that, that's all you have to do. You just have your elastic bands like this. Make sure they even. You always gotta make sure they even out. And then, once they're evened out, you just grip them and have them ready. Once they are ready, you stand in an even position. Uh, there's certain stances you could do, and I'm gonna show you another camera angle. at the other camera angle it's the position your freak you be in keep it straight like this just straight even just keep it straight even like this or if you want to you put your right foot out like this but keep even keep straight and then do your workout like that or or you can Take out your left foot, but keep your keep your legs straight and even, and then just do the workout to help your stance better. But either way you go, you'll be fine. And don't worry, just keep doing your best, and that's all you can do. And remember, just keep it consistent and it'll go good. Now I'm about to go back. So my original camera angle. Now since I showed you at another camera angle, I could go back to the rubber bands right quick. Now once you're in this position, you just keep your feet straight. The harder you grip your bands, the better the workout will be. All you do is grip them real hard, have them even. Go straight up, just like you're doing the rubber bands, and go straight forward till you hit your fists together. And that's one, and that's two. shape up your chest into the right formation even if you're doing push-ups and anything like that always do your butterflies too to make your chest form better and you'll even feel stronger too you'll be walking around like hey I'm picking the, this gallon of milk up easier or hey you know I'm playing the sports that I play playing it better and things in that nature it'll, it'll boost you up you will be more energized and all I'm doing today, I'm doing three sets of 10. And if you do these, you could do them like twice a week, I said. You know, if you just start, even if you do them once a week, it's better than, you know, not doing them at all. So keep that in mind and always take your time at whatever you do and just, and don't put yourself down. You always gotta keep trying and keep trying. It's, it takes a process, but it'll work out. And now, 
while I'm feeling energy, I'm gonna go back and do the second set. Now, when you're doing a second set or you know you're halfway through, just take your time at it and keep going with it, keep it consistent. Now, if the if you're doing these and the bands is not feeling tight enough or you don't feel nothing in your chest, you can scoot up forward because the farther forward you go, the more resistance more resistance the further you go up and the further back you go the less but the resistance is up to you and your choice so always remember that and keep that in mind I'm gonna do my second set and I can do it one foot out I'm gonna do it my right foot out one your temple up and make sure you're keeping it strong so when you out you know you stay ready you ain't got to get ready and keep that in mind too you always got to remember that and you only have one of you so make sure you protect yourselves at all times and do your best in anything that you're good at or you know you want to try something new you could try something new and just keep working at it it takes time it always takes time and you know, some people, they are able to do it real fast, but don't don't ever like compete with them or, you know, no competition. Just stay on your golden paths and you'll do good. And if, you, if you're in pain or, you know, having a sick day and not feeling good in the gym, all you gotta do is take a day off or, you know, I'd rather lose one day of not working out then lose 30 if I rip a muscle or you know anything like that so safety you always got to keep yourself protected and work at it and now I'm about to go ahead and do the last set now I got my left foot out keep the stance going I'm gonna go ahead and do my 10 exercises you can but always always remember to just take your time and you got this you got it don't let nobody push you down and stay tuned but before I go if you're doing the rubber bands and your fist is not if your fist is not connecting don't worry even if they get like real close and go back you still did one but you know just try to Try to get your wrist to connect and the rough and elastic bands and different weight sets so get the weight that you're comfortable with and just you know do your best and you got to get that charge in too so you get better and better and better so keep that in mind and i love all y'all out there that's watching stay tuned for more future videos and hit the like button it's free Hit the like button, subscribe, spread the news and spread the word about Consistency 101 and even Kim Greedemans. Kim Greedemans got a lot of information over there too, so keep that in mind. I love all y'all out there that's watching. Stay tuned for more future videos to come. And see y'all in the next future videos.